First tonight at five, the Satanic Temple suing the Memphis Shelby County School Board of Education. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Stephanie Skurlock. Hi there, I'm Shay Arthur and for Greg tonight. Now that lawsuit comes as the temple sponsors the controversial after school Satan Club at a Cordova Elementary School. And tonight the group claims the district is defying members of their First Amendment rights. Now I spoke with one of the group's organizers who says filing the lawsuit comes after months of discrimination. They've been charging us excess fees. Um, they've been attempting to block us in every way possible, um, ignoring our emails. Um, everything has been last minute. Um, it, you know, when it comes to approvals, we don't know what's going on. We don't know where we stand. It's an extensive lawsuit. The Satanic Temple versus Shelby County Board of Education. The crux, the after school Satan Club at Chimney Rock Elementary claims it is being discriminated against when it comes to the usage of school facilities. The group comparing itself to another group sponsored by Child Evangelism Evangelism, they claim doesn't experience the same issues, saying MSCS has attempted to thwart the Satanic Temple at every turn in order to constructively block and deter the ASSC from meeting at Chimney Rock Elementary. Writing in part, there has been illegal and discriminatory treatment motivated by MSCS officials and community members' overt hostility, and MSCS has chosen to defy the First Amendment. The Satanic Temple claims to be a non-theistic religion that views Satan as a figure who represents championing the human mind and spirit. The group says the club does not attempt to convert children to any religious ideology. Memphis Shelby County School District leaders and parents have voiced their opposition to the club in the past. I want to assure you that I do not endorse, I do not support the beliefs of this organization at the center of the recent headlines. But acknowledge nonprofit organizations seeking to use facilities after school hours are allowed equal access. As the superintendent, I am duty bound to uphold our board policy, state laws, and the Constitution. The lawsuit also cites fees the ASSC has been charged as unconstitutional. The group alleging at one point they were given a large special security fee for more than $2,000 for 10 additional security officers for four hours and charged another $250 for field lights. We are seeking nominal damages of $1. Um, there's a uh, this false rumor, false con uh, perception that the Satanic Temple goes around suing, looking for opportunities to sue for millions and millions of dollars. The Satanic Temple sues for equal access and equal rights. Now that group also says the district and school isn't communicating with them in a timely manner when it comes to renting facilities, forcing them to move meeting to in the morning. MSCS told us it does not comment on pending litigation, and we also reached out to the school board chair for a comment. So far, we have not heard back.